then I'd just close by saying that one other sad area where patients may miss an opportunity to get the most effective therapy is because of the cost or other practical issues. These oral therapies often cost more than $10,000 a month. Unfortunately, that's very rarely what a patient would pay for them, but sometimes co-pays can be hundreds or even over $1,000 a month, and that may be prohibitive for many patients. Uh, but a social worker, an oncology social worker, uh, pharmacy specialists, and various others uh, through your cancer center may be able to identify programs that can provide support or work with the company that provides the medication to find a patient assistance program to significantly reduce or even eliminate the cost and provide free or much cheaper uh, drug because nobody, including the company selling that drug, wants patients to be priced out of an effective therapy that could help them for a long time to come. So just to say again that there are many steps in the process of uh, precision medicine and identifying a driver mutation, but one of the important areas that where there are gaps is actually patients having a driver mutation but not ending up getting the best treatment for whatever reason. And that happens, it looks like from the, re the evidence we have, up to nearly a third of the time. And I hope that patients and caregivers can be helpful advocates to ensure that that doesn't happen to you.